I have random thoughts in my head, and sometimes I let them come out of my mouth. Hi guys, welcome back to Random Thoughts. I'm Dee Marie. And I'm Ashley. And uh, before we get started, we wanted to promote J Zump's jewelry. This is handmade jewelry from a good friend of ours. Jen Zampetta, and you can check out her website. We'll leave the link to her Etsy shop. You gotta check out her handmade jewelry. And these really cute bows that she makes. So you have to go to thedemarie.com so that you can find out how to get your own cute little bows. I'm wearing a Packers one today. So handmade jewelry and handmade uh, bows, and we'll leave the links down below. We wanted to continue the conversation that we were talking about at the end of the last video, where do you ever think that your dreams are uh, memories of your past lives. So actually starting out, do you believe in past lives reincarnation? I don't. No. No. I believe that there's a possibility. Yeah. Yeah. I don't, I mean, I don't, because, okay, I'm more of a spiritual person. I do believe in Christianity, but I don't believe that, um, I know I'm going to sound like a blast here, but I don't believe that the Bible is the end all be all. I do mm -hmm. believe there are some things we just don't know and that yeah. everything is possible. So I do believe that reincarnation is possible. Mm -hmm. There's just no way to prove it. Yeah. You know? And the way I feel, like, I always said, like, um, growing up, we used to call um, my nephew and my daughter old souls. And everyone would always say, oh, you can tell they used to be here. Yeah. Because they just always seem like they knew things they shouldn't know. Like, See? they've already gone And I have, like, before. a theory about that, too. Like, I, I don't believe that there um, is... Like that people have past lives, but I do believe in like that thing that you were saying because like, you know, I think it was Tasia where everybody used to say that about her, mm -hmm. how she was like an old soul and people would always be like, she's been here before. Like the way that she acts and like does certain things, yeah. like, you can just tell she's way too familiar. Mm -hmm. And so like, I don't think that that means that she has been here before, but like I kind of have like this little idea in my mind that like when you're a baby before you can talk like that you are able to interact with like angels and things of like the spiritual world like mm -hmm. i hope not like demonic spirits but like i feel like if you have family that has passed on that like in their spiritual form they somehow are able to interact with like you know babies mm -hmm. and so like i think that's kind of like what if you see a baby they're like giggling and like yeah. laughing in their yeah. sleep i definitely agree with that and so like i think maybe that has something to do with like that old soul thing like mm -hmm. the way that you know because they are interacting with these family members that have passed on or with these you know angels like that's why they may have some kind of familiarity to them okay so it's not necessarily that they've been here before right. it's just that they've been taught things right by other right people who have been right here. Okay, I can see that. I mean, like I said, I am. I believe that everything is possible. Yeah. So, I, I I can see where that that comes from. I don't know. Let us know. Do you, do you feel that reincarnation is real, or that you know we can communicate with people, at least children, and that's how you get that feeling of them being here before? All right, guys, we're gonna close these random thoughts out with the random question of the day, which is. Okay, if you were to throw throw a theme party, what would it be? 90s. 90s. I was just talking to her about this because I saw something that Zoe Deschanel, who's the girl that plays a new girl, um, she has like some kind of website that she has, and she posted something on Facebook that said like the top 15 parties to throw this year, and one of them was a 90s party. And before I even saw that, me and my husband were talking about how fun it would be to do that, like. And like, I like dress that. up like you know TLC or yeah. you know like with the condom on the glass. Yes. <laughs> or wasn't it like an egg, like a sunny side up egg? It was or different every time. Yeah. But it was always covering yeah. that eye. And I yeah. miss that, like the whole style. I like of, the like, bright colors. Of well, the I miss movies. like the the tight tops mm -hmm. with like the super baggy jeans, oh, and I then do that like all the, time. the lugs. Were they the lugs or like the Timberlands? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Tim's, yes. Tim's. Like that looks just seems yes. so comfortable. Yes. I, I want an invitation and I will be there. <laughs> um, plus the pants, they weren't all low. They were like up yeah, they were up. Yeah, they were Yeah, yeah. Um, if I were to have a theme party, it would be the 20s. 
I love the twenties and the flappers and really and the, oh my gosh, I always, I wouldn't know what to wear. I I always like it's the long pearls with the tight cap hair and you know the pin curls that, that were really tight fun. to your head and like the speak easy and guys were like yeah. in suits that were pinstripes. Yes, yeah. like I love the twenties. That is totally my thing. So I guess I would have a twenties theme party. All right, guys. Well, let us know what type of theme party you would have. And do you believe in reincarnation? Let us know what other topics you want us to talk about. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll check you guys later. Bye. Hey, don't just watch random thoughts. Be a guest. Email me at thedmarie82 at gmail.com and tell me what you want to talk about.